फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट सर द इलेक्शन कमीशन हैड एस्टिमेटेड दैट इफ द वोटिंग एज इज रिड्यूज एन एडिशनल नंबर ऑफ फोर्टी सेवन मिलियन विल बी कम एंटाइटल्ड टू वोट दे विल हैव टू बी इन्यूमरेटेड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ अ डोर टू डोर सर्वे द इलेक्शन कमीशन विल टेक नेसेसरी स्टेप्स इन दिस रिगार्ड वंस बोथ हाउसेज ऑफ पार्लियामेंट अप्रूव द बिल विथ योर परमिशन आई शैल नाउ डील विथ द प्रोविजन्स ऑफ द रिप्रजेंटेशन ऑफ द पीपल बिल ओवर द ईयर्स there has been an increasing tendencies to vitiate the electoral process malpractices and lawlessness have been on the increase we had therefore to think in terms of effective measures to check such evil tendencies the election commission is a constitutional authority and is vested with plenary powers in the matter of superintendence direction and control on all matters prior to and the actual conduct of elections to parliament and legislative assemblies of the states it is to be strengthened to take all necessary measures for ensuring free and fair elections as the members are aware the election commission is dependent on the machinery of the state government concerned both in respect of the work of preparation revision and correction of electoral rolls and the work in respect of the actual conduct of elections such staff functions under the superintendence direction and control of the election commission in so far as the work relating to the election is concerned they do this work in addition to their normal functions under the state government thus the state government employees are subject to dual control one by the state government concerned in respect of the regular work and another by the election commission in respect of the election work it is therefore felt necessary that the disciplinary control over the state government staff in respect of work relating to elections should be vested in the election commission an amendment therefore has been proposed that self staff would be deemed to be on deputation to the election commission so that they are brought under its disciplinary authority the exercise of jurisdiction by the state government over their staff in relation to their normal work even during the period of elections would continue to rest with the state government india is a parliamentary democracy based on party system a large number of political parties are also functioning the democratic election process is to be sustained by the political parties stop